Welcome to the Great Mosque of Cordoba. The Great Mosque of Cordoba in Spain's Andalusia was actually a small church, but when Muslims ruled Spain, the Umayyad commander Abdurrahman I ordered the establishment of the Great Mosque in 784. Historians said they believe in the site of this mosque stood a temple to the Roman god Janus, and then it was transformed into a church by invading Visigoths who took control of Cordoba in 572. Who were the Visigoths? Well, they were a German Gothic group who played a role in the fall of the Roman Empire. The church was then converted into a mosque, which was later rebuilt by descendants of the exiled Umayyads, which was the first Islamic dynasty that originally ruled from its capital Damascus from 661 until 750. The Great Mosque of Cordoba was used as the main place for prayer. It was also a hall for teaching Islam and a site for Sharia law cases. The mosque's design is inspired by the Great Mosque of Damascus, the Dome of the Rock, and the Aachen Cathedral. However, when Cordoba was conquered by King Ferdinand III of Castile in 1236, the center of the Great Mosque was changed into a Catholic church, and later, Christian features were added, such as chapels and a nave. The minaret of the mosque was also converted to the Bell Tower. It has been said that Abdurrahman I is buried in the mosque. He named it Al Yama Mosque in honor of his wife before the name changed to the Great Mosque of Cordoba. In 1984, the mosque was recorded in the list of UNESCO's World Heritage Sites as the historic center of Cordoba. Hope you found this interesting. See you in the next episode.